So I found a rice cooker. I don't have a link to it in front of me, but there was a rice cooker that I stumbled upon. So I love rice. Me too. Rice is fucking delicious. It's, it's so, so good. good. And Tim, like back in the day, I and mean, you'll remember this quite well, but when we when you were into a continuous glucose monitors, and then you got me into them shortly after, you used to have to like manually inject yourself with that big ass syringe. Do you remember to put those in? Oh, so bad. It was Do you so remember bad. how it was bad? Like a, it, was, it was like a barbecue fork tongue that you had to stick yeah. in your abdomen. It was really yeah. bad. And you would watch the needle go in. There was like no quick mm. action. You had like push it in and push no. it out. And then you would no, get this continuous terrible. glucose monitor. And this is like, you know, whatever, 10 years ago. And you started doing it. I thought you were crazy. And then I, I like copied you like two months later and started doing it. Later, three months later, I started doing it. <laughs> and one yeah. of the things I noticed and I've noticed since my entire time doing CGMs is that rice is my biggest offender. If I mm. eat a cup of rice, my shit is through the roof on the glucose side. And everybody's different. Mm. Everybody has different microbiome. There's a whole slew of factors on what happens here. But here's the interesting thing. Toshiba who is a trusted brand, came out with a quote-unquote low-carb rice cooker. And I was like, what the fuck is this? Like, low-carb, like, this bullshit, right? We all know rice is high-carb. Oh, what are they talking about? Brown rice? You know, like, all this shit, right? Even brown rice spikes me, by the way. So I, I went, I did the research, and what they've done is they created this clever little basket. They figured out that a typical rice cooker, 99.9% .9 of rice cookers, you pour the water in, cook the rice, it stews in its own water, and your rice is done. You scoop it in your bowl. A bunch of the starch, call it like 70 or so percent of it, is released in that water during the, the kind of the process of actually making and cooking the rice. So Toshiba invented a new rice cooker. They call it their Fuzzy Logic technology rice cooker that has a basket that lets all of the starchy water drain to the bottom and you end up with a much lower glycemic load. It cuts the carbs by 37%. And dude, I ate a cup of rice and I'm telling you, I can see it on my CGM. It does not spike me nearly as much as the full rice, which I thought was pretty awesome. And I wouldn't have believed this in anyone else, but Toshiba came out with it. And I was like, okay, if Toshiba's going to put their name behind it, like they must have done yeah. the research, you know? Yeah, they're a big dog. It's $179. It's like, if you're, if you want to just cut a little bit of carbs out of you or you, rice is a big offender for you, this works with like, you know, they, it works with oatmeal, it works with the whole slew of brown rice, white rice, quinoa, the whole range of things. But anyway, I just thought it was really cool. It's got 1,852 ratings with four and a half out of five stars, 4.6 stars out of five. So people love it. 300 plus have bought it in the last month. Let me ask you this. Taste-wise, yeah. is it as I good? It is it? Okay. A little bit on the texture, a little tiny bit on the texture, but like, I'd say like, call it a maybe five to seven percent delta from what you're normally experiencing on rice so it's you're not pissed it's fine yeah, yeah. nobody's complaining that's a big deal it's a big deal i fucking love rice there are so many rice carbs that i can i'm like whatever i can do without it i love rice oh my god do i love rice